Good morning. And you know, the more I look into heaven, the more excited I get at just what we're going to experience when we get there and what we're going to see. I tell you, saints of God, children of the light, we have so much to look forward to. You know, again, you know, yesterday we looked at Revelation 22, verse 1. But if we move on now to verse 2, we read this from God's word. In the middle of its street and on either side of the river was the tree of life, which bore 12 fruits, each tree yielding its fruit, each tree yielding its fruit every month. The leaves of the tree were for the healings of the nations. Again, the river of life pointing to healing, pointing to restoration of all things as it flows down the middle of the street with trees lined up either side of it, yielding fruit. I mean, I love fruit. I'm a bit of a fruit nut myself. And a <laughs> fruit nut. Anyway, you see, and this indicates, again, that in heaven we will be actually eating. We can, we'll have the, the choice, the option to eat in heaven. After Jesus rose from the dead, he ate fish and bread with, with the disciples at the Lake of Galilee in his resurrected body. The angels in Genesis 18, they ate with Abraham. Can you imagine, you know, you're in the glory and it's like, yep, yeah, you know, the, the angels are coming around for a spot of tea today. Or, or, you know, the seraphims coming in for for, for some fruit. Hey, you know, we're going to be, we can eat in heaven. There's a marriage feast of the Lamb. There's going to be a celebration. that you, this, We're going to taste the new wine of the kingdom of God. You know, the, the indicator here is that we will eat of the fruit of these trees in heaven, which is replenished every month. Every month there's going to be a fresh crop of fruit on these trees for all of eternity. These trees will never ever die because they're getting their water from the river of life. The fruit that they produce will be for life and for health. The leaves are for the healing of the nations. In Greek, this can mean health giving. The leaves are for health giving. That's the root of the meaning here, which also refers to, to, to ministry and to serving. You know, so God's going to be giving, giving leaves for the healing of the nations. He wants the nations to be healthy. And as the nations partake of the leaves of these trees, they will be given, they will be given health. In the heavenly city of God, there, there's going to be no pollution, no sickness, no illness, nothing horrid that, that comes out of the heart, you know. And this life is going to flow from God's throne through the city and out into the nations for healing. You know, no more cancers, no more leukemia, no more tumours, no more AIDS. It is going no no hepatitis A or B is going to be awesome, absolutely fantastic. You know that there's going to be health, vitality, life, youth rejuvenated, restored, and permanently maintained. You're never going to get sick again. I mean, what a reward it, 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 it is that. I, you know, one of my friends I know, he's, he's he hasn't been well for years and, and he suffers terribly at times. And, and he says, one day I'm going to be in the glory and this will be no more and will never, ever be again. What I'm going through now this illness will never happen to me again when I am in the glory. I've got so much to look forward to. 
and it, and that's so true of us. We have so much to look forward to. The best is yet to come. Here on earth, I think we get glimpses of God's beauty, of, of, of God's health, and, and the fitness that he wants us to have. But in heaven, oh, it's just going to be, you know, every cell in your body radiating with the glory of the Lord Jesus Christ. Fully functional, mental fit most you know it's, it's going to be great god is so so good and here we're seeing that this river of life supporting these trees to bear fruit every month and leaves for the healing of the nations our god is a good good god and, and in, he is a god who will restore and gives health to us we are looking forward to such an amazing place no more hospitals in the glory. Praise God. Let's pray. Heavenly Father, thank you so much that you give health, Lord. Lord, you give health in such a wonderful, wonderful way. Lord, we have so much to look forward to when we reach those celestial shores. Lord, we thank you that you are concerned about us even now. And you place hope within us for the, our future destination. Lord, and I do pray this morning as well for all who are sick and are ill and who are struggling. I do pray, Lord, that you just touch them, that you just bless them, Lord, and, and take away their suffering and their pain and give them strong hope, Lord, of what is to come. Lord, we look forward to seeing this river and these trees in your holy city on that day when you call us. And may the Lord continue to walk with you wherever you are at, wherever you are to, and keep looking up because that's where we're going. Bless you.